With more than 30,000 cars driven every day into London and a chronic shortage of available parking spaces, traffic becomes congested and extra fuel is burnt to add to the fumes emitted in our city. Research shows that over 50% of the traffic in cities is simply cars driving around searching for a vacant, convenient parking space. This problem for London's transport is in immediate need of a solution. This programme will look into the technology of automated, robotic parking. These claim to be a revolutionary innovation that is a reliable and rapid way to solve car parking. An automated car park gives space for twice the number of cars in the same space as a traditional car park, or it will use half the space to park the same number of cars. The car park is completely computerized, with two identical elevator systems that are able to move simultaneously in both vertical and horizontal directions and communicate with each other by wireless transmitters. The driver parks their car on a steel pallet guided by an LED signboard and then turns off the engine and gets out. After locking the car, the driver swipes a card in front of a magnetic reader as an automatic elevator door closes around the car. The car park's computer figures out which of the hundreds of spaces a vehicle should occupy and then delivers it there, untouched by human hands. It considers the vehicle's size, putting the larger 4x4s on lower levels and the driver's schedule on previous visits, putting vehicles whose owners enter and exit frequently on the slots that the system can access most easily. When the owner returns for the car and swipes their card again, the process begins in reverse. Within seconds, another electronic sign announces at which bay the car will appear, still on the pallet where the parker placed it. The average wait to retrieve a car was 2.5 minutes. The technology is also used in car showrooms for an eye-catching way to display the cars. They say it's an optimal use of available space at sites of high demand. An example is the Toyota Tower in Germany, which uses the building for storage for customer cars during service and repair operations. The facility allows customers to deposit and retrieve their own vehicles directly, simplifying this section of business. Also, the modern transparent design offers customers the opportunity to view all aspects of ongoing operations and in themselves provide an interesting landmark. With around 20% of all car crimes in England occurring in car parks, it is important to introduce a solution which will also help people's security. A robotic car park has ground level access only, meaning vandals cannot access the cars and thieves cannot steal from your vehicle. A car cannot be damaged by other drivers, as it has its individual enclosed space within the building. There will be no need to worry when walking alone at night, as the terminals are well lit when retrieving your car. The one-floor car park also grants easier access to disabled drivers, who currently have a limited option in central London, with only five of Westminster's car parks built with a lift. This equipment will increasingly play an integral part in future domestic, commercial and industrial developments as architects strive to optimise available space and their clients' investments. They may provide one of the solutions to the most important conflict in urban design, where do you put all the cars when the car volume is high and space is at a premium? It may now be time for London to invest their surplus finance from car parking revenue into a productive solution to car parking in our capital before the increase of traffic from 2012.